Okay, we're going on our recovery. We got the recovery dog, Snowy. We got Jake, who's gonna be filming with the camera. We're going down to Burl Wash, that's up past Boulder City, to uh, get a truck that broke its rear differential and broke a front CV axle, so it's dead weight. We're gonna be pulling it back up to the road so it can get uh, towed by a tow truck or a flatbed truck, I'm not sure. Um, we're heading out now, it is about 1.30. I have a friend of mine, Joe, who's coming with his Toyota Land Cruiser, um, just in case we need to tie onto each other to you know, help pull this dead weight out. But uh, we'll be taking some film and we'll be back with you and let you see it. Okay, we're almost halfway to uh, the Chevy truck that's broken and uh, Joe's back there on the trail somewhere. Follow me to see him. There was a tow truck that came by which I was surprised that a tow truck could be on this road. It was four wheel drive. It was towing the Jeep that had burned its clutch up. And they told me to watch out that there's a minivan down here that another tow truck is coming for. What I want to know is how a minivan made it down here and why, why would you take a minivan down here? So I'll show you that video and those pictures when I get to see it. I mean, look at what I'm about to climb up right now. out and right down there is a Chevy truck it's white right there almost there and supposedly there's a minivan down here I can't wait to see that How's it going? It's going. Um, you have somebody coming to get you? That's my understanding. Okay. All right. Well, we're coming down here to get that Chevy truck. Good but, luck. Yeah. You know what? Uh, a four-wheel drive. A four-wheel drive. Uh, Jeep. Uh, no, a tow truck from Henderson came and got that Jeep. Yeah, I do. We saw him. He told me there was a minivan down here and I didn't believe him. Have a good one.
we are. I'm gonna go ahead and go up and turn around. Let me see. Which axle's broken? Not even aired down. This road's kind of hairy. I'm going to go ahead and get my recovery gear. Pass the camera to Jake so he can record me getting the gear out. And... Sure, now you want to get in the back. Nope. Get up there. Oh, stay. Get her some water. Back up. So we're gonna have a couple trucks put together. So we're gonna need more straps. And I have a lot of straps. Go around that van. The van stuck too. I stopped and talked to him for a minute. Yeah, I still don't know how it got. That's why I asked. I don't know how the hell he made it here. He goes, I made it down just fine. He uh, tore up his tranny pan. He what? Tore up his tra transmission pan. Oh yeah. All right, Joe. You want to come here and uh, pick what strap you want? All right. Well, let me. I'll just try to do this one first, and if not. But you stay ahead of me just in case. Then I have chains and all that stuff too. Okay.
we have to hook onto you as well. Because uh, we might have to pull three to pull them out. Everybody loves those third gens. Who broke his shaft? He broke front and rear. So, oh, the strap broke. <laughs> <laughs> 